Hey guys and welcome back. It's so great to see all of your beautiful smiling faces and thank you for joining me from all over across the world. I know I've got viewers now in Indonesia and Australia and India and America and England of course. So thanks so much for, for tuning in. Um, today we've got just a quick power yoga flow. So uh, without further ado, grab your mat and your workout gear and I'll meet you back here in just a moment. to the front of your mat. Place your toes together, your heels slightly apart, bring your hands to prayer at your heart center. Take a nice deep inhale through the nose and exhale. Take a moment to set an intention for your practice today. Maybe it's one to breathe, one to relax. Whatever it is, send all of your energy and your thoughts back to this one thing throughout today's practice. And with that, inhale, take the hands high overhead. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, come halfway, lengthen. And exhale, place the hands to the mat, step or jump your feet back and lower, down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. And exhale, downward dog. Go ahead and pedal out the feet here, maybe move the hips from side to side, really waking the body up this morning inhale and exhale again inhale and exhale one more breath inhale and exhale bend the knees inhale step or jump your feet between your hands and exhale take a forward fold inhale rise all the way back up and exhale Samasthiti to he's standing again inhale and exhale, fold. Inhale, come halfway, lengthen. And exhale, place the hands to the mat, step or jump your feet back and lower, down, chaturanga. Inhale, rolling over those toes, upward dog, opening the chest to the ceiling. And exhale, making your way into a downward dog. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, really pressing the hands into the mat, spreading the fingers out nice and wide. Pulling the shoulders down your back, lifting the hips to the sky. Take a little bend in the knees and try to lift the hips just a bit higher. And then slowly work to press the heels down towards the mat. So don't worry about getting them to the mat. But I want you to focus on feeling the stretch to the whole entire back body. One more breath here. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Go ahead and bend the knees. And as you exhale, step or jump your feet between your hands and take a forward fold. Inhale, rise all the way back up. And exhale, Samasthiti to he's standing. One more, inhale, hands come to the sky. And we exhale, forward fold. Inhale, come halfway, lengthen. And exhale, place the hands to the mat, step or jump your feet back and lower, down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. And again, we're five breaths here, inhale. Just taking that time this morning to wake that body up. You might be a little bit stiff after getting out of bed. Don't worry, it happens to all of us, inhale. I struggle to touch my toes in the morning when I get out of bed, exhale. Inhale. And exhale. One more breath, inhale. And exhale, bend the knees. Inhale, step or jump your feet between your hands and exhale, take the forward fold. Inhale, rise all the way back up and exhale, Samasthiti to he standing. Moving on, inhale, come to chair pose and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, come halfway, lengthen and exhale, place the hands to the mat, step or jump your feet back and lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog, opening through that chest and exhale, downward dog. Inhale, lift the right leg high to the sky and exhale, step it forward between your hands. Inhale, rise up, warrior one. And exhale, come back down, step back and lower, down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, 
exhale downward dog inhale left leg lift it high to the sky and exhale step it forward between your hands inhale rise up warrior one and exhale come back down step back and lower down chaturanga inhale upward dog exhale downward dog and we're five breaths here inhale and exhale using this time to really maintain the breath as we move through the practice today inhale and exhale bringing the focus back to the breath back to the practice inhale and exhale one more inhale and exhale inhale i want you to go ahead and bend the knees and step or jump your feet between your hands and exhale forward fold inhale rise up chair pose and exhale samasatihi standing we'll do one more inhale come to chair pose and exhale forward fold inhale come halfway lengthen and exhale place the hands to the mat step or jump your feet back and lower down chaturanga inhale upward dog exhale downward dog inhale right leg lift it high to the sky and exhale step it forward between your hands inhale rise up warrior one and exhale come back down step back and lower down chaturanga inhale upward dog exhale downward dog inhale left leg lift it high to the sky and exhale step it forward between your hands inhale rise up warrior one and exhale come back down step back and lower down chaturanga inhale upward dog exhale downward dog and we're five breaths here inhale and exhale really engaging through that ujjayi breath in through the nose and out through the nose inhale and exhale last breath in and exhale bend your knees inhale step or jump your feet between your hands and exhale take the forward fold inhale rise up chair pose and exhale sama he standing okay guys moving on inhale we're gonna vinyasa to our downward dog and we're gonna exhale forward fold inhale come halfway lengthen and exhale place the hands to the mat step or jump your feet back and lower down chaturanga inhale upward dog exhale downward dog inhale lift your right leg high to the sky and exhale bend your knee inhale open up through that chest maybe wiggle that ankle roll it around in a circle inhale keep opening for that hip flexor exhale inhale and exhale good inhale lift that leg high to the sky and exhale step it forward between your hands inhale rise up warrior one and exhale hold inhale and exhale pulling the shoulders away from the ears tucking through the belly button inhale lifting the fingers to the sky exhale one more breath inhale and exhale inhale we're going to open up through warrior two straighten the front leg reach forward with the right hand bring it down to the shin or down to the mat take the left hand to the ceiling and we're in triangle pose inhale drawing the belly button to spine exhale really feeling a stretch to the front of that right leg inhale so you're really getting into that hamstring exhale last breath in and exhale inhale i want you to take both your hands to the side of the room and we're just going to hold to the side so engaging through those obliques inhale and exhale inhale keep squeezing through those thighs exhale squeezing through the belly button inhale and exhale inhale come all the way back up we're gonna make our way into warrior two exhale inhale keep reaching through those hands in opposite directions gaze over your right middle finger this time inhale and exhale inhale and exhale inhale flip the right palm to the sky reach it up and over we're in a reverse warrior inhale gaze to that right middle finger 
exhale. Keep drawing the belly up and in, inhale. And exhale. Couple more, inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale, great job. Inhale, we're gonna straighten up through our warrior two and come into a side lunge. So take the right elbow to the right knee, reach the left hand up and over, take the gaze to the left middle finger, inhale. Try to sink in a little bit deeper if you can, exhale. Inhale, really feeling the stretch to the inside of the right thigh, exhale. Again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, we're gonna drop the right hand to the mat, take the left hand behind your back, and you're gonna take the right hand under the thigh and you're gonna go for a bind. So you're gonna open up through the chest, inhale. So keep trying to open that left shoulder to the ceiling, exhale. If you can't bind, that's okay. Just reach for the right hand to the ground and tuck the left hand behind your back to open through the shoulder, inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, slowly release, and I want you to pivot to the center, and we're coming into a prasarita. Inhale, lengthen through the spine, and exhale, I want you to bring the crown of the head to the ground. Inhale, and exhale. Take the weight into the toes. Inhale, and exhale. Last breath in, and exhale. Inhale, take the right hand to the left ankle, and I want you to take a little bit of a twist. So lift the left hand to the ceiling, pulling yourself down to the left thigh. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, I want you to pivot to the back of your mat this time, and we're going to do everything on the other side. So we're gonna inhale, make our way up into a warrior one, and exhale, hold. Inhale, taking the gaze to the ceiling, pulling the shoulders down the back, exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Come again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, we're gonna open up through our warrior two, straighten the left leg, reach forward with the left hand, bring it down to the ground or to the shin and bring the right hand to the ceiling, inhale. And exhale, gaze to the right middle finger, inhale. And exhale, keep working on bringing the belly in nice and tight, inhale. The stretch should be through the back side of your left leg, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale, looking great, guys. Inhale, we're gonna take the hands over to the side and we're gonna hold, working through the obliques. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Two more, inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, open up, we're coming into our warrior two. And exhale, sink in nice and deep. Take the gaze to the left middle finger, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. One more breath, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, flip the left palm to the sky and exhale. Bring it up and over, we're in a reverse warrior, inhale. Taking the gaze to the left middle finger, exhale. Make sure that front leg is still bent, inhale. So pressing into that left leg, exhale. Inhale, reaching back through the left fingertips, exhale. One more breath, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, coming through your warrior two, we're gonna make our way into a lunge. So left elbow to left knee and right hand comes up and over. Taking the gaze to the right middle finger, inhale. Really feeling this in the inside of that left thigh. Exhale, and we sink a little bit deeper. Inhale, you're looking great. And exhale. Again, inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale, we're gonna take it a little bit deeper. So reach the left hand down to the ground. Tuck the right hand behind the back. And if you can, come to the bind. So you're gonna take the left hand under the thigh, grab the hands behind the back and open the chest to the sky. If you don't have the bind, that's okay. You're welcome to keep the left hand extended to the mat, inhale. And exhale. Last two breaths, inhale. 
and exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, slowly release. Make your way back to your Peraza Reed. And this time, taking those peace fingers, you're going to grab your big toes and use your arms to help pull yourself down towards the ground. Inhale, taking the weight into the toes. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, this time walk your left hand over to your right ankle and take the right hand to the ceiling, pulling yourself down towards the right thigh. Inhale, opening through that chest. And exhale, feeling the stretch all the way down the back of the right leg, maybe a little bit in the left as well. Inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, slowly release, make your way back to the front, and you're going to step the right foot back and lower, down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale, you're going to lift the right leg to the sky, and you're going to exhale, bring it through, and you're going to thread it through the left side, and lift the left hand to the sky as you inhale, and exhale. Well, two more breaths, inhale, and exhale. Last breath in, and exhale. Inhale, take both hands back to the mat, and exhale, lift the leg high to the sky and bring it all the way around. You're gonna drop it down to the ground and lift through the chest, we're in wild thing, inhale. Opening through that front body, pressing the hips to the sky, exhale. Inhale, and exhale. One more inhale, and exhale. Inhale, we're going to make our way back to our side. Stack the feet. And I want you just to open up through that side body. Take a nice arch, reaching through the right fingertips. Getting a stretch all the way down the right side of the ribs. Inhale. And exhale. And kind of make your way back to plank. Lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Same thing, other side. Inhale, left leg lifted high to the sky. And exhale, take a little bend in the knee, opening up through the chest. Inhale. And exhale, straighten the leg to the sky. You're going to reach the leg through to the right side this time, lifting the right hand off the ground. Inhale. And exhale. Two more. Inhale. Hang in there, guys. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, take both hands back to the mat. Lift the left leg to the sky and exhale, tuck it behind. And you're going to drop that foot all the way to the ground. Lift the hips to the sky. Reach back, lifting through the chest, lifting through the hips. Inhale. We're in wild thing. And exhale. Two more breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Last breath in. And exhale. Inhale, make your way to a side plank, stacking your feet. And I want you to lift the hips as far as you can to the ceiling, reaching and arching through the side rib cage. Inhale. Hang in there, guys. Looking good. Exhale. Making a nice rainbow with the body. Inhale. And exhale. Make your way back to plank. Lower down to your knees. And come into a child's pose. Take a nice little rest. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. One more inhale. And exhale. Inhale, we're going to come forward to our all fours on our hands and knees, and we're going to work into a headstand. So we'll take different variations depending on where you are in your practice, and we'll get there together. So you're going to go ahead and grab the opposite arms. And so your arms are going to be one arm distance apart. You're going to lace those fingers, tuck the bottom finger underneath. The top of your head goes into the mat. The back part goes into your hands. And you're going to rise into a downward dog and walk the feet in as close as they'll go. So this is step number one, pressing into the ground so everybody can get to here. So bring a little bit of weight and pressure into the head as we inhale. And exhale. And if you're ready to take it a little bit further, you're going to inhale and you're going to lift one leg to the sky and exhale. And you're welcome to stay here. So this is point number two to rest at. Inhale. And exhale. If you're feeling really confident, you can bend that back leg. Keep pushing into that back leg and lift your other leg off the ground. Inhale. And exhale, keep breathing as we inhale. And exhale. And if you're confident here, you're welcome to bring your feet together. If not, keep them split. So wherever you are, stay in that position and keep breathing. Inhale. And exhale. 
Inhale. If your feet are together, I want you to work on bending through the hips and exhale, slowly bringing the feet down to the mat. And then once they touch the mat, I want you to inhale and lift them right back up. So you inhale and exhale, lift. Come all the way back up, inhale and exhale. Again, bring them down, inhale and exhale. And then make your way into a child's pose. Slowly relaxing and letting the whole practice be absorbed into the body. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, I want you to take the hands and I want you to reach them out in front of you. And exhale, I want you to walk them out to the left. Inhale. And stretch on that right side body. Exhale. Then walk your hands over to the right. Bring the stretch to that left side body this time. Inhale. And exhale. Again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, bring the hands back to the front. Take a nice reach forward. Try to press the chest down to the mat. So keep walking those hands forward so the hips lift. Inhale. Opening through those shoulders. And exhale. And inhale. And exhale. Inhale, come to all fours. And we're just going to quickly round the spine up. Nice arch through the spine. Maybe wiggle from side to side. Exhale, pressing through the belly down to the ground. Lifting through the chest. Inhale. And exhale. I want you to make your way all the way to your back. And we're coming into our final resting pose. Just taking a moment to let the whole practice be absorbed into the body. We'll take three deep breaths together. In through the nose and out through the mouth. So inhale. And exhale. Again, inhale. And exhale. One more breath. And exhale. Just take the time to relax, letting the whole practice be absorbed into your body. start to wiggle those fingers and those toes, bringing awareness back into the body. Inhale, take a nice deep reach overhead, waking up that body. And when you're ready, slowly make your way to a seated position at the front of your mat. Keeping the eyes closed, bringing the hands to prayer at your heart center. Take a moment to observe how you feel any aches, any pains or emotions running through the body. Just acknowledge them. Thank yourself for your time and for the energy that you've shared with everyone here today. Here's your prayer to your third eye. Namaste. Excellent job today, guys. Um, thank you so much for taking the time out to join me on the mat today. I know it was a quick flow, but it's a great one to get your morning started, especially if you don't have any time. And I will see you all again next week.